Previously on Hardline. What we have is a network of cops, military contractors, and border patrol. By paying us, you get access to that network. If we get this phone into one of those briefcases, we can track it. You want to steal Dawes' dirty money before it gets laundered. Sounds fun, actually, but you're on your own. Yeah, the wife Kang might be an old friend of mine. <laughs> you get started? I figured you could probably use a hand back here. <laughs> hey, did you guys see the news? What, the Rourke thing? Apparently, you two caused $3 million worth of damage. The guy literally lives in a glass house. Oh, yeah! You're gonna love this. Bam! What is that? Where Dawes is keeping his dirty money? Your little tracker scheme worked? Now, right here, this is where Kai's phone wound up. Dawes' corporate HQ. I mean, the place is a beast. We're talking private elevators, blast-resistant windows. Wait, I know that building. That's right on Foster Key off mainland Miami. And this is a work order for a vault that was installed in the penthouse suite six months ago. Okay, tell me about it. Foot-thick steel door with a combination lock and magnetic seal. So we blow it open? Ah, uh, the amount of explosives needed would level the building. So we don't blow it open, or do we? Now, I used to hang with some folks that have an auto-dialer. It's like a safe-cracking robot. They called it the Brute. I mean, the thing is fast, man. It could power open any combination safe. Call him. Tell him we need to borrow it. I already did. We just need to pick it up. Long way to come for a safe cracker. You really used to live out here? Oh, yeah. I was a little screwy after the army, you know, made a local friend, so I hung around for a while. Don't ask, don't tell, huh? Oh, that's funny. What'd you do in the army? Intelligence analyst. But no skills to work, I see. <laughs> Look, you try getting a straight job with a dishonorable discharge on your record during a recession. It's a long story, man. I went AWOL. For how long? Technically, I'm still AWOL. <laughs> so what about you, man? What's your story? Oh, Marcus! Soon! Oh! You got a little fat. What? You got a little looking good. <laughs> I'm gross. If I wasn't covered in dust, I'd be like SBF 5800 out here. <laughs> <laughs> oh, oh, I'm sorry. This is uh, uh, the friend I was telling you about. Hi, I'm Nick. Hello there, Mr. Nick. <laughs> oh, you look great. You really do. Thank you. So do you have the safe cracker thing or not? No, no, we have to go to the compound to pick it up. Oh, the compound. I, I thought you, you were gonna, um... Is your dad gonna be there? Oh my god, he's not mad at you anymore. Really? I mean, he's not gonna pop the champagne when he sees you, but... <laughs> so I guess we're gonna go pick it up then. Hey, do you guys mind driving? Sure, why not? Awesome! Go to the right here, Nick. So what have you been doing these days? Same old. Local or offshore? Mostly offshore. Where am I going? Follow the road, I'll tell you when to turn. So are you like enjoying the work? I'm enjoying the money. So what do you do, Nick? I work with Boomer. Oh, boys up to no good. So exciting. <laughs> so how's your daddy? He's still carrying that fucking gun. Marcus. The world is not your own personal diorama. He's over it. All right, I got to know what happened with you two. Well, we can... Marcus and I were very much in love. Mm -hmm. My father didn't approve. Oh, I can give you one guess why. So when Marcus left the community, he tried to... Leave with you. ...kidnap me, my dad said, mm. which was so fucking romantic, but which kind of upset my dad, I guess. Show him your bracelet. Oh, GPS. So he always knows where I am. <laughs> Great. Yeah. 
So your dad sounds intense. He was in SEAL Team 6. Oh, he was not in SEAL and Team 6. due to problems with the socialist tyranny of the American government, he founded a community of like-minded patriots. <laughs> patriots? Are guys here armed? Totally armed. Oh, Nick, it's cool. I know these people. They're mostly hippies. Actually, all the hippies you knew are gone. What? Where'd they go? Just gone. Dirt road straight ahead, that's ours. Marcus Boone, the prodigal, etc. <laughs> hey, Mr. Albert, thanks for seeing us. Oh, it's the least I can do. And you must be Nick. Boomer says you got a machine that can brute force any combination lock. Well, certainly can, Nick. You just gotta give it a little time. Nick Mendoza, right? Oh, hey, look at that. Shit just got real. My dad kind of monitors my calls. Yeah. A lot of people want to talk to you, Mendoza. Including a fella from L.A. named Stoddard. Say he'd pay 250 grand for you alive. He's coming here right now. Sorry, Marcus. Boys, what do you say we escort Mr. Mendoza and Marcus down to the presidential suite? Wait, you said just Nick. <laughs> Marcus isn't welcome here. He never was. Oh, baby. I'm so sorry. Oh, peel her off this asshole before I puke. Oh, and Marcus, just so we're clear, race is not a factor here. My dislike of you is strictly personal. gave it to me when she hugged me. Dune, who just set us up? Dune, who set you up? She's, uh, she's actually really good people. Oh, sure. All right, stay behind me. Okay, yeah, go ahead. We gotta find a way out of here. There ain't no argument here. What the hell is this place anyway? Missile silo. It can mission in early 90s. Please tell me Albert doesn't have a nuke. Okay, this way.
Here. Okay. How many, uh, how many rounds you got? Not many. Okay, come on, let's find that escape hatch. Never liked that Marcus kid anyway. Little fucking know-it-all. Can't believe you guys used to let scumbags like that live around here. Shit, we had them Mexicans. <laughs> Hey, one of these idiots had my scanner. Hey, there's a ladder. That's our way out. Yeah. Come on. <laughs> All right. We need to get our gear back. What? Are you nuts? Let's just get out of here. Look, if Stoddard gets his hands on it, he'll trace it right back to Kai and Tyson. Okay, we can't risk that. Shit. All right, so how you want to take this, man? There's a lot of Alpert's dudes down there. Uh, looks like there's a place to climb in on the left. Okay, but, but, or we could crawl under that fence over there on the right. Yeah, or we could take them head on. What? If you're up for that. Man, you lead. I'll be right behind you. That's what I thought. Unfortunately. Let's just go. Come on. You will get this black man killed. I feel it. Hey, who drank my beer? Nobody's wanting your light ass beer. I got whiskey over here, you friggin' light. We'll get you!
One way out of here, man. Come on, let's head for the road. Right here, get in. Come on! Quick, get in the car! Hey, you wanna talk about what's going on here? It's like these guys are geared up for their old private apocalypse. Yeah, Tony's kinda flipped his lid. You think? What do you guys even need a safe cracking robot for anyway? Uh, to steal something? Well, at least it's being used for a noble cause. Head for the airstrip. That's where your brood is. Okay, and you're sure it's there? Yes, I'm sure. That's where Tony keeps all his crap. Just drive. Okay, look. There's one thing I want to know. Oh, just one? Hey, well, there's man. a lot of things I'd like to Could know. Could you just hang on? Dooney, why'd you let your dad lure us into a trap? I assumed Nick was just one of your dirtbag friends, but then I found out he's a cop, which is kind of worse, but whatever. <laughs> whatever, whatever. You know you're coming with us now, right? Oh, really? Jesus! Oh, fuck, Boomer! What if instead I turn you both over to this Stoddard person and collect my 250 grand? What the hell, woman? <laughs> I'm totally messing with you guys. God, you were crazy. The gun's not even loaded. Shit. <laughs>
Is everyone okay? Dude's been hit! That shot in the arm. Yeah, my leg's broken. Oh, we gotta get you some help. Marcus, those guys that ambushed us, they're coming. You remember this thing? Right. Nick, hold him off while I do some triage. There's guns in the trunk. You got it. Now, for the record, this place has changed a lot. That's all of them. Hey, you okay? I need you to do me a favor. Tony's a hunter, so I could use a diversion. Decided I kind of hate the desert. So you're not coming with us? We can get you to a hospital. Nah. You seem kind of busy. Airfield's that way, you better hurry. Hey, Dooney. Oh, yeah. Good luck. See you around? And tell Tony I think he's a wang. <laughs> Check out that burnt out house before we go. The fire looks kind of recent. I told you dudes good people. 
Your dad's gonna come after us with everything he's got, you know. Now if we leave first, it's an airfield, right? Maybe we'll find a plane. So, uh, what did Dune mean when she said Tony keeps all his crap at this airstrip? Tony's always kind of collected shit. The less legal, the better. Really? So what are we talking about here? Military black market shit. Tanks, choppers. He's even got a couple of grounded planes. Tony's got a lot of money, man. Drug stuff. Plus, he's real literal about his Second Amendment rights. No, that's it. The old airfield. Keep going. Airfield's just ahead. You know, I find it hard to believe you're a cop. Yeah, well, my dad was a cop, too. For real? But not the kind you're thinking of. You know the SDE? Cuban secret police? Oh, okay, wait, well, so what, you, you followed in his footsteps? Hey, you tell me, man. His job was torturing prisoners. And he liked to bring his work home, you know what I mean? That's why he became a cop. A real cop. Sorry, man. I'm sorry that didn't work out. Well, it turns out you don't have to be a cop to stop people like him. Time to walk. Come on. guys are already here. Uh, 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 do you see, like, a, uh, uh, a warehouse across the way? Yeah. Yeah, it's barricaded. You can't sneak in? Oh, hang on. Yeah, I think I got an idea. It might be a little loud. Zach! You said loud! Not loose here! Oh, shit! Where are these guys coming from? Boomer, Tony's guys are already here. Uh, 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 do you see, like, a, uh, 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 a warehouse across the way? Yeah. Yeah, it's barricaded. You can't sneak in? Oh, hang on. Hey, I think I got an idea. It might be a little loud.
Boomer, Tony's guys are already here. Uh, uh, do you see, like, a, uh, uh, a warehouse across the way? Yeah. Yeah, it's barricaded. You can't sneak in? Oh, hang on. Hey, I think I got an idea. It might be a little loud. Boomer, I got the brute. them off.
not encouraging. Join up with Kai and Tyson. We are going straight to Miami. Yeah, told you I could fix it. Radios, uniforms, C4, scuba gear, harnesses, cable trolley, and one safe-cracking robot. So we're good, right? We are good. Let's get to Miami. Wait. We gotta give this place one last sweep. We don't want to leave anything incriminating behind. Okay. Let me know when you're ready to go. What the fuck is that hissing? <laughs> Oh, oh, I just yes. thought you could hide from me, Mendoza! I taught you everything you know! How's it going, Nick? Damn it, shoot this prick! Oh, don't you? That's some bad luck! Damn it, Kai! Yeah, sorry. It's Dawes. What, you want to answer him? Say hello? <laughs> Straight to dead guy voicemail. Wait, what are you doing? Dawes is gonna probably want an update. I'm sending him one. Tyson, where the hell are you? You should have come out of there by now. It's been over an hour. Maybe you got lost. There's a sign on the door that leads to the tank. How hard could it be? Hey guys, sorry, I got lost. Where the hell are you? Finding the water tank was easy. Finding the drainage, not so much. More pipes than a church organ in there. Hey Tyson, man, stay away from the cameras. Relax. All they're seeing is a hard-working window washer. Get the cable ready. We're moving in. Minimal radio contact from here on out. Got it. Man, could Dawes have put his office in a more evil looking building? Be glad he's in that building. Otherwise, we'd be screwed. Wait a minute. Does every skyscraper down here have a water tank at the top? Most of them. Keeps them from rocking during hurricane season. Biometric elevators and all the bulletproof glass. Dolls must think that penthouse of his is pretty much impregnable. I guess we'll find out, won't we? Come on. Tyson's dropping the cable any minute. There, I got another one. Fireworks kind of suck. Here's the van.
Give me a minute. Come on, We're kind of on the clock here, Boomer. Yeah, I know. One thing. Are you guys really sure about this? A little late for that, isn't it? Look, I'm just asking. Look, if I was gonna have a million gallons of water drop, 200,000 or 200,000 gallons or whatever, I would want someone to make sure I'm safe. That's all I'm saying. Hey, you got another way up to that penthouse? I'll take it. And blowing out that stabilizer tank was your idea. Hey, it seemed a lot more doable when we weren't about to do it. Jesus. Tyson's back on schedule. Give me the C4. Here. Got a peanut butter and jelly sandwich in here, too? Well, I could write bomb across it if you want. Come on, let's get this over with. Get the cable to the boat. Man, I ought to be up there with the brute. You want to trade jobs? You know, actually, I think I'm good. Have fun. Nice try. If you want to get a look into the lobby, the parking garage on the right has a good vantage. There's a few ways inside. Looks like it. Loading dock in the back, mezzanine staircase on the side. Also, there's the front door. And lots of guards. And lots of guards. How many men does it take to guard them? Yes. Keep them. What the fuck's going on? Okay, okay. Hands are right here. Get this guy! <clears throat> I got this one, Nick. Gotta be a clue here. Okay, bet I can figure out this code. Hi, elevator's unlocked. A lot of guards for the 4th of July. Think Dawes knows we're coming? Maybe. But not how we're coming. Guys, I'm on the 19th 
19th floor, but it's a guard party up here. All right. Then we go to 20. Hit him from above. Nice. So tell me, what did you do for 4th of July when you were a kid? You know, put fish sauce on hot dogs, watch stuff explode. Tyson, we're on 20. Welcome to Preferred Outcomes. I'm outside a corner office. Looks like it's under construction. We're on our way. He's right! Stop it! Look out! Let's go! <laughs> Move up! Let's go! They're on! Tyson said he was in the corner office, right? Hey, come on, come on. Here, Boomer packed you a lunch. Hey, you know, I actually haven't robbed a place in probably eight days. Hey, you sure you found the right pipe? I'm sure. And I think you two are nuts. Let's get upstairs. Now comes the fun part. Dawes relies on that private elevator to keep his penthouse safe. Boomer did say it was unhackable. Good thing we're not hacking it. All clear. You two Aquanauts can blow the charges anytime. 10-4. That's Dawes' wife in that photo. Put your mask on. You sure about this? Hey, if we want that money, I have to push this button. Right. Back in L.A., you told me to trust you, and I did. And look where that got you. Say, relax, Kai. It's gonna work. I have no idea if this is gonna work. Then I guess it is my turn to trust you. Do it.
You good? Yeah, but we better let Tyson in. Let's hurry. Someone's bound to call 911 about the explosion. Doubt it. Dawes wouldn't want any cops around here. I'll find something to open the doors. Anytime. I bet that touch screen opens the door. Computer might be worth a look. Here we go. Well, it's nice to see your boss still alive. I'll say this for a former cop. Does has taste. Now that, that is a $24,000 coffee table. You know those magazines for rich people that no rich person actually reads? I subscribe to all of them. Unlike you two bivalves, I have an appreciation for the finer things. Hey, come on. Just get the brute working on the vault. Okay. Where the hell is it? Oh, shit. Good question. Okay, everybody look around. Vault's gotta be here somewhere. Tells me Dawes read a lot of comic books as a kid. All right, here goes. Okay, there, that, that. That should do it. Okay, brute, do your thing. You're not gonna keep an eye on it? It's not like it needs encouragement. Guys, I got bad news. Let me guess. Company. How many? You remember my worst case scenario? Yeah. That many. All right, they're coming. Get ready. There's weapons in Dawson's office. Set up for these guys. Traps, explosives, anything you've got. They're gonna be coming at us down those hallways. We need to slow these guys down. Nick, if you've got trip mines, set them up now. What's that? They're here. Take a look around. These guys came to play rough. Right out! Look out! Look out! Get out of there! Ah, fuck him! Ah. 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 Ah.
How much longer for the brute? I don't know, maybe it'll beep when it's done. You know, like a microwave. Oh shit, they cut the power. Get ready, more coming. If you've got a night vision scope, now's the time to use it. If not, check the weapons locker in Jaws' office. 